Welcome to the JCC Samson Challenge at the Jewish Community Center on Wyoming. This competition will combine strength and endurance, and we guarantee to put you to the test. You'd better be ready to sweat and grunt. The Samson Challenge is sponsored by the one and only American Home Furniture. The fittest and fastest dads will be receiving brand new recliners from American Home. The challenge starts with a 500 meter sandbag carry, which is two laps around the JCC athletic field. Take a rest if you need it, but cardiac arrest is strictly forbidden. Immediately after the sandbag carry, athletes will move on to tire flips. Do I need to remind you about no brakes? Strong legs and shoulders are needed to perform these flips. Five flips forward and five flips back. After which, athletes will sprint, jog, or walk to the other side of the field around the orange flags. After returning from the tire flips and the associated refreshing cardio pain, the athletes continue the challenge with a 50-meter farmer's carry. Keep your core strong and your lats engaged during this event. Athletes on this video would receive a one-minute penalty due to not going around the flags. The farmer's carry is the best cardio known to man, so no extra sprints are needed in this section. You will find out why as you establish your own leisurely rhythm on this obstacle. After huffing and puffing, oops, excuse me. After finishing the farmer's carry, athletes will move over to a sled pull for 50 meters. Like with all the events, the sleds are preloaded for different fitness levels. Feet are to stay relatively planted during this event, although you will want to use your whole body. Make sure to finish by turning the sled around for the athlete following you. A one minute penalty will be applied if you forget to do this action of fair play. Just because we promised you a bit of cardio, the athletes take another sprint, jog, walk to the end of the field and back. If you're still able and willing to return for more, you will be moving on to medicine ball throws over a rope. A total of 10 throws accompanied by alternating 10 burpees will be performed at your own rapid pace. Our average Joe and Jane can leave the burpees out if they like. After the throws, you will take yet another hike to the end of the field and back. At this point, you will have performed five events and congratulations, you are now halfway through the challenge. Feel free to quit now. We are only talking about your prime here. Your sixth event is a wheelbarrow load, push, unload for 50 meters out and back. You are responsible for loading your wheelbarrow, taking it around the flags 50 meters away, bringing it back and unloading it. If you forget to unload, a one minute penalty will be added to your time. If you are still determined to finish the challenge, you will be moving on to a 50-meter tire run, followed by a 50-meter army crawl. After no break, you will be able to tackle the custom Samson Challenge obstacle. After that obstacle, you will race to the end of the field for the very last time, which will prepare you for the last event of the Samson Challenge. Our 10th and final event is top secret. We can't tell you, or we would have to kill you. We can only reveal that it will be wet and slippery. If, after watching this video, you still think that you've got what it takes to beat the Samson Challenge, we will question your sanity. But we love your enthusiasm. Sign your consent and liability waiver and give it a try. Whether you are a warrior, a jock, or an average Joe or Jane, we wish you good luck. And we'll see if you got what it takes to meet the JCC Samson Challenge. We'll see you on Father's Day at the Jewish Community Center on Wyoming.